All right, well, I'm gonna go back and heal, since, you know, that jerk warmed me up, I guess. I feel like I'm underleveled, to be honest. I feel like I shouldn't, er, I feel like I should be hitting a lot more, or having a lot more stuff to do more damage and stuff. Since I can't really, like, upgrade how much damage I do, aside from, like, getting charge and how much flower power and stuff I have, and I'm watching you recording, you better not mess up on me. And it didn't. Wow, that was, that was nice. I like it. So, uh, yeah, let's head back. Let's get this done ASAP. I'm trying to blaze through this game before the end of this week, so I can just go home, or edit it, upload it, and then be done with it. Because, if you... Okay, he's dead. <laughs> he's not just frozen, he's dead. Um, or cryo sleep, Odin sleep or something. Hello. Uh, I'm guessing I need to get a scarf and a hat. Just taking a random guess, and I think there's something behind here. Yes, there is. Did repel gel. Uh, nah. I don't need no, uh, repel or whatever. Um, oh great. This is fun. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I've been having issues with recording. Hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been having issues with recording. Like my holy crap. Um, I probably should have swapped. These guys look like they can wreck face. And I have a feeling they are going to. I... what? Do I have it where it just... No, that said HP drain. I didn't... I did nothing. How did I get health? Uh, that's a cattle. This is the Frost Piranha. Frost Piranhas are frozen piranha plants. Max HP 10, 4, and 0. They'll try to freeze you with their icy breath. They'll be at their mercy if they freeze you, so you better try to immobilize them right away. Ice attacks won't work. They love ice. Fire attacks, though... Do I even have any fire attacks? Oh man, oh man, that sucks. Oh crap, I'm... I'm screwed. I'm gonna die. I'm s I'm totally gonna die. Oh no... Oh no, I didn't save either, So if I die I have to do all that over again. Oh my gosh. I can't even block, I'm so dead. Oh, no! <laughs> no! These guys destroyed me, oh my gosh. Oh, I completely forgot I had those. I'm getting the crap out of here. I'm so glad I bought those. Uh, yeah. No thank you. I do not want any... Actually, I probably should have scanned before I left. Well, um... Valuable lesson learned. Save. Often. Um... Scan. The enemy. So you know what they can do. And... Try to not get frozen. Because getting frozen sucks. And I don't think I have any person that can actually do, like, fire damage or anything. Don't I have a uh, badge that gives me fire? Or something? Uh, blah, blah. Uh, I don't know if this has helped me much. I'm gonna keep it on, though. Okay. That won't help me any. I need the, uh... Whoops. I need fire damage. That'd be nice in this area. Because then I just destroyed them. But instead they destroyed me. Pretty nicely. If I do say so myself. Okay, so it seems that... What is this? 
potato found in the shiver region. Cool. I can cook with it, probably. I would imagine. And I need to save. <laughs> and we're good. So if I die, then I'm good. I have a feeling I, I can't remember if I saved or not after I beat that penguin or freaking this dude. I can't remember his name. Junior. I'll just call him Junior because his name is Junior. But, uh, as soon as I get out here, I'm going to pull out, um, Barrio, so I can scan everything here, because everything is a mystery to me, and I don't want to die. Hopefully there's not a bajillion people in this... Oh, come on. Alright, uh, give me a nice tattle. And gulpits. This is a gulpit. Oh, gulpits are pretty burly, don't they? Yes, they do. Next is 12, attack power 2. Gulpits attack by picking rocks up in their mouths and then spitting them back out. The bigger the rock they spit, the more damage you'll take. Big rocks take 7 in damage, and small ones take 5. They can't do much damage without ammo, so you should concentrate on the rocks first. How do I destroy rocks? <laughs> Whatever. I guess I just destroyed the rocks. Wow, I got a lot of health for that. Oh, come on. Ugh. I'm just taking a whole bunch of unnecessary damage. Oh, this stinks so much. Um, I need to do this. I got a lot of health for that, though. I really like this perk. This perk is a good guy. Um, multi -bonk. Ah, come on. Once I get that timing down... Ooh, good. I can actually block that. Once I get that timing down, um, for Goombardi's multi bonk then I should be good. And they're out of rocks now. So I have less to worry about, but I'm still really low on... Ah, oh, I did not want to do that. <sighs> they better give me a lot of... Three? Three. Really. Oh well. Dang it. I'm really sucking on these... Uh... Whew. I'm really sucking on these action commands here. <laughs> give me health, please. Power Quake. There we go. Better give me five health again, because that was nice. Ah, uh, give me three. Whatever, health is health. Um... Please die. Yes! And I can take two damage. Or one. <laughs> and uh, I'll just hammer you to oblivion. If not, then uh, I'll just bounce on you. Yep. Give me health. Give me two. That works. Doesn't even matter. Okay, so these guys suck. I don't want to fight these guys often. In fact, I want to avoid confrontation with them as much as I can. Nope. There's a letter. Oh, come on. Um... Whatever. Do I have multi-bonk? No, I mean, not multi-bonk, multi-jump thing. No, I don't. Uh... I want to level up, so I'm just gonna fight these guys. Whatever. I got some health out of it, though. Let's try multi-bonk. Okay. That was nice. Oh, come on. That dodge is ne I'm never gonna get that, more than likely. I like how Goombario does more damage than I do. Then again, I am using an ability, so... I don't know. He does more damage than me. My partners do more damage than me. That's sad. Or at least he does. I don't know about everybody else. Still, though. Oh, boy. What the heck is this guy? 
Turn back, come no farther, turn away, or I'll eat you. What do you think, scary monster, aren't I? You know you wanna run. Oh my gosh. Um... Monstar. Well, since Kubari is out, uh, might as well tattle on Monstar here. This monster, even I don't know what it is. I don't know why, but it looks really terrifying. I get the funny feeling I had a nightmare about it. Next HP 20, depends power 0. I don't... I don't know its attack power, but it must be very powerful, judging by its looks. It's probably gonna be a joke of a fight, to be quite honest. I feel like that's gonna happen. As long as he doesn't hit 13, then I don't care. I don't know how to block this. Pfft. Are you I'm so scared. Oh man. Honestly, I just feel like getting health from this guy. <laughs> Give me all your health. Eh, I don't even care, I'm just gonna kill you. Well, not on this turn, obviously. Well, I was right, this guy was a joke. Watch him hit me for like 50. That would suck. Oh man, I was just off on that. I don't know how to dodge that. <laughs> My attacks don't hurt you at all. Of course they don't. Of course they don't. As long as you give me a level up, I'm not mad. And he definitely gave me a level up. And I... yes. Three. Alright, um... I have no idea what I need to just start dumping everything in to. I feel like flower power is necessary. I mean, it is. I might just start dumping everything in flower power so I can do more damage. Uh. Hmm. I'll just. I need to start just dumping everything into that. What? It's a whole bunch of tinks. The heck was that? <laughs> I like that like one frame thumbs up he gave. Hey, it's a this place is nice. Oh, there's that guy. Oh, you're Mario. Yes, thank you for coming. How do you do? I'm called Merly. I care for the star kids born here in Stardom Valley. There are many things I must tell you, but not here. Come, let's go to my house. I cannot concentrate out here in this cold. This way, please follow me. Well, um, I'll follow you in just a second. I must apologize for the rude reception of the star kids. None of us suspected that you'd come here so quickly. They frightened strangers to try to keep this village safe from Bowser's followers. Please, you must forgive them. Sure, why not? They gave me a whole. They gave me a level up. So I don't care. Please get the star rod back from Bowser Mario. The Mushroom Kingdom deserves to be at peace. Good luck. What I need to do is heal. And oh, pff, never mind. I'm good. I forgot. Just leveled up. Oh, come on. Well, I can save, so I don't need to deal with anything else. Alright. Come in, please. I will. Oh, cool, I don't have to actually hit A. Alright, what you want to talk about? Now, Mario, you must head... You must heed well what I'm about to tell you. This frozen area is called Star Morton Valley. It is named this because it is here that stars are born and raised before rising to the sky. What? Oh. But now, ever since Bowser stole the Star Rod from Starhaven, the power of the star, the power of that place has weakened, and Star Kids have found themselves unable to rise up into the sky. I sent a ninji to my father Merlin, hoping that I could coax you to come here, because I have found out where the last star spirit is. It came to me in a dream, a vision of the last star spirit begging me for help. If my vision speaks truly, then the last star spirit is being held atop Shiver Mountain, which lies to the north. Atop sits the ca Crystal Palace, the star spirit that waits there. Crystal Palace was originally built to honor the stars, but as time passed, it slowly faded from the memories of local people. And now, no one can remember how to reach the palace. There's a way, though, and it involves items that have been passed down in these lands. Here, take this. It's probably- yep. It's a scarf and a hat. The scarf has been passed down through many generations in Starborn Valley. I wish I knew how to use it, but I do not. According to the legend, you must use this and another item that has been passed down in Shiver City. If you hope to open the way to Crystal Palace, sadly, that's all I know. 
I just need the hat. Where's the hat? If things remain as they are, Star Kids will never again be able to rise to Star Haven. Such a fate would be awful. Please help them and expel Bowser from the sky. I will. I just need the hat. Which I don't have. Oh, wait. Is he going to give me the hat? Is he going to give me the hat? Oh, yes. Mario almost forgot. There's supposed to be a small shrine somewhere along the path to the Crystal Palace. A legend has been handed down in this valley regarding the shrine's secret. Truth lies not only in the eyes, sometimes even walls may lie. Confusing, yes, but you must find the shrine and solve its mystery to reach the Crystal Palace. Please don't forget it. I got my hand full of a lot of sack of... Where is the hat? Uh, along with the news, uh, fairy warning, uh, blah, whatever. Can I get the hat from somebody? This guy's teaching people. What are you teaching? Oh, no, he's cooking. Uh, okay, cool. Where is this hat at? I know I need a hat. I just don't know where to get it. Um, oh well. I guess I'll just go ahead and pop the, uh... Oh, come on, please go away. Oh, cool. There's a ton of people here now. What the heck? Why are there so many enemies here now? Uh, scarf. I don't have a hat. I need the hat. Uh, I guess I'll go talk to... What's his name? Oops. I don't know who has the hat. I really hope the mayor has the hat. <laughs> Or I don't have to go somewhere extremely far away just to get the stupid hat. Um, I'm gonna check with this guy first. Oh wait, he did give him a present. And th that might be the hat. I remember this. My secret room is closed now, depending on the... Um, yeah. Yeah, you should. Oh, come on. Where do I get this hat from? I'll go talk to the mayor, and if not, then I have no idea where to look. Uh, there's a snowman. Hmm. I'm trying to think where else could it be if it's not here. Unless I take it from a <laughs> an already made snowman, which I guess I could, but that'd be mean. Are you are you still gonna be stupid? Hi there, how are you? Anyways, mystery novels become very popular here in Shore City. But when I became a character in a mystery, I realized that I'm not so fond of books like that. I'm serious, I mean it's only penguin poetry for me now. Yeah, good for you. Oh Mario, did you reach Starburn Born Valley? Did you see him early? Oh excellent, he said what? Uh, that has been passed down in the city. Um, alright, there was something like that. Just a minute, I think I've got it somewhere. Please don't slip and break your head. Yep, that's it. This bucket has been passed down through the years in Shiver City. As Merle must have told you, there is a legend associated with it. Yeah, I know all that. Sounds like the Star Kids in Starburn Valley are in trouble. I hope you do your best for the little tykes. They're just kids, best of luck to you. And off we go. I suppose I should probably stock up before I go, also. And I might actually just take a second to figure out recipes and stuff that I can make and make them. So I'm going to save, and then I'll be back with you guys shortly. So stick around, please. <laughs>